Uh, dear colleagues, we do endorse the declaration we've contributed to. We believe in, in that schooling has no alternative. Closed schools is an alarm of losing a generation. And the fact, and we believe in the fact that lack of education leads to attracting our students to violent movements. We are concerned about the lack of resources for education globally. Girls in hard to reach, mar marginalized, insecure, underinvested, and culturally sensitive contexts are going to be affected, affected the hardest. And the achievements of our fragile state of the past 20 years will come under question if we don't stress this, this fact in the ongoing peace talks in Doha. We are committed to opening our schools and we have successfully opened our schools uh, since the past two months. We will continue to work towards inclusion and equity. And we call on all world leaders to increase and prioritize education financing, support innovations and partner with us to get every child quality education. And finally, in light of the peace negotiations taking place in Doha with the Taliban, we urge world leaders to help voice up on girls and boys concerns to not jeopardize their education for the sake of peace. And we're hopeful that world leaders will listen to the voices of our students across the country. Thank you very much.